guys welcome back to my channel this is Christina and in today's video I'm going to be doing a flamingo inspired makeup tutorial I have just been seeing a lot of flamingos around on the internet in the stores and I really love flamingos they're super cute and of course I love pink so I thought this would be a good tutorial for some summer makeup and I'm also going to be using the Smashbox Cover Shot Pinks Plus Palms Eyeshadow Palette. And this is going to give a really, really good look for this flamingo inspired makeup tutorial. So if you haven't subscribed yet, please feel free to do that before you leave. And if you end up liking this video, please give it a thumbs up. It is greatly appreciated. And let's jump right into today's video. Okay guys, so I've already put foundation on, bronzed, blushed, highlighted, and I've already like set my face, done my brows, all that. So we're just going to be focusing mostly today on the eyes and the lips. In the description box below, I will be leaving the foundation and bronzer and all that stuff that I've used already on my face so you guys can see what I actually have used since I did that off camera. And today I'm gonna to be using the Smashbox Cover Shot Pinks Plus Palms Eyeshadow Palette. And this is the inside. I want you guys to see these beautiful colors. Aren't they gorgeous? I just love it. It's if you don't think of flamingos when you see this palette, I don't even know what you're thinking about. It just reminds me of flamingos so, so much. So let's jump right in to the eyes. So to start off, I'm going to be using a big fluffy brush. And I'm going to go in with this lightest pink shade all over my lid. This is the brush I'm going to be using. Oh my gosh. You guys. This was open and I picked it up by the lid and we about had a disaster. I am so, so glad we didn't. Okay, back to the eyeshadow. Taking that pink and I'm just gonna put it all over the lid. Okay, and next I am going to be going in with this color right here. This is the second darkest pink in this palette. And I'm gonna be using the same brush and I'm gonna go into the crease area with this. These colors are so gorgeous. I haven't been using pink eyeshadows for some reason and I am super excited about this palette because these pinks are so pretty. So, so pretty. Okay, I'm gonna be taking a smaller crease fluffy brush and I'm going to be going into this next darkest shade in the palette. I'm also going to be working that on the crease but it's going to be right under the pink that I just put on. I'm not going to go up so high with it. To try to go a little bit darker. I'm going to take this brush right here and I'm going to go into this magenta e pink right here and I'm going to put that on the outer corner. Wow, you guys, these colors really. 
I'm loving this. And I'm just gonna bring that up to the crease. I think I could use like every shade in this palette. They're just so pretty. I think I'm gonna go ahead and take some on the lower lash line. I'm gonna use this brush right here. I think I'm gonna go into this shade right here though. I don't think I wanna use this darkest shade on my lower lash line. And that just connects everything together to give it a seamless look. And for the lid, let's see. I think I'm going to use this glittery pink and I'm going to wet my brush with the MAC Fix Plus just to make it a little bit more vibrant. And I'm just going to pack this color all over the lid. Oh my gosh. You guys, this color, I am living. It is too, too pretty. Gosh, I love it. Okay, I'm gonna take this brush again and I'm gonna go back into this medium color right here. And I'm going to just blend all of this together. What I've already done. Don't like any harsh lines. Hey, that is looking really, really good. Okay, I'm gonna take my finger and I'm gonna go into this light pink right up here and I'm just gonna pop that in the inner corner for a little extra glue. Oh my gosh. And these colors are super pigmented also. It's, it's just giving me life right now. I'm loving it loving this that's good we are done with the eyeshadow i'm going to put a little bit of this benefit highbrow on my brow bone and i'm going to blend that out with my finger just to give me some highlight and this stuff really pops it like it's just adds like some brightness to the eye area. It's super, super pretty and really easy to blend. All right, and I'm going to put a little bit of this Wet n Wild Mega Last Eyeliner just on the bottom waterline. Then I'm going to use the They're Real by Benefit for mascara. This is some really good mascara. It adds a lot of length and volume, which I really love. I mean, look at the difference. I mean, and these are real. <laughs> um, for the Smashbox cover shot, this is the first palette that I've actually bought from the cover shot line, but they have like, I want to say like six or maybe even eight. They have eight different palettes and if they all look as good as this one does, I may be buying all of them because they are really, really good so far. And I don't know if you've seen this, but it's so cool, the cover of it. I love it. 
Okay, so now I'm going to be putting on the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Liquid Lip. And this is the color Temptation. Okay, you guys, this is the finished look, and I think it looks very flamingo y and pink, pretty, everything I would want for summer. And I really, really love this lip stuff. It smells so good and it's so soft, so soft on the lips. It feels so good. I have hardly found cheap liquid lips that feel as good as this. So this might be a new go-to for some liquid lips at the drugstore. But I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you can see my future videos. And if you click the little notification bell, you will get notified every time I upload a new video, which is very helpful. You don't have to just wonder when I'm uploading. It will tell you I've uploaded a new video. And so, yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's pink flamingo inspired makeup tutorial for the summer. And I hope you guys have a good rest of the day and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.